Hi guys and welcome to a new doll box opening and review video. Today I have a pay pinky doll with me and I ordered her back in November. I kind of wanted her for my birthday but they take a long time to arrive, normally 50 days. So after I ordered her I was thinking okay maybe I'm going to get her for Christmas because a lot of people were getting theirs. And it still didn't happen, so I was like, okay, I'll have her for New Year, it's fine. And still nothing happened, and like, it took more than 70 days for this one to come around, so it took a very, very long time. And it was not like a normal order, because I ordered her a uh, different than the set they have on Etsy. So probably if you order the set, like the full set dolls they have on Etsy, it doesn't take so long but I ordered her with a different wig and with a different clothes and I wanted a special face up so a lot of different little things and I ordered also two extra outfits with her so I guess my order took like a long longer time to prepare than a normal order so anyway guys I'm going to open the box I already opened the box normally you have something to attach it so I'm going to show you the card. She comes with a card. So first let's show the card and then I'm going to show you the box and open the doll for you. So this is a card. So it's like a print of some art of a mermaid by the same artist that does the doll. And it says, thank you, have a happy birthday on it. And actually I checked it out like the the doll already and she comes with little extra things so, as a birthday present so that's pretty cool anyway guys let's open the box so this doll come in a sort of shoe size box because she's that tiny so let's have a look what's going on so we have here now let me put that here we have here a picture of the different type of doll that you can get from this artist. So there is Miko and Soso and Ipat and um, I don't remember the name of the other doll. So you have five dolls here. There is Boo Boo and Baby also which are small versions. So that's a lot of different dolls. And I already have a Soso that you probably saw on the video before and I took some picture of her so I have a Soso and this one is a Miko then uh, I got this extra wig so I didn't order a wig so this is kind of like birthday present I guess extra little something that she put in the box then we have this extra little box here with the shoe for the doll and the outfit so we have the first outfit which is like knitted outfit so that's the top and you can open it with the ribbon here and then she has like this kind of combination outfit with like three different type of fabric so you have the little arts here and stripes and polka dot and then you have less on it and a little button and this is how it looks in the back so that's the outfit number one I'm not sure what I'm going to dress my Miko in yet so let's put them all on the side and we're going to decide then here we have so this is a little dress with blue socks and a little dress so you can see here how the all for the arms so our arms go through the piece through here and it's made of some sort of um it was probably white fabric but it has this stained in some sort of pink and going darker in some area and it has extra little fabric on it and buttons and the lace as well and the lace also has been painted at the bottom so it's pretty nice and the last outfit is 
another outfit with socks and these are that could be leg warmer or wrist warmer or sleeve for the dress and here is a little dress so it's made of like there is two sides so you have some fabric and then you have less on the top and a ribbon and it's attached with a little button so it's the same as the back and always it's attached with that ribbon so maybe I'm gonna make her wear this one okay so there there is a cushion it's kind of a cushion blanket and my little Miko is here and she actually arrived with a little rabbit so I didn't order the rabbit so the rabbit is like an extra probably like birthday present and I'm kind of glad she has a little pet because it's a long travel from Greece to Japan so it's good that she wasn't alone and then here is the doll herself so I wanted her with a sort of little freckles and the blue green eyes so those eyes are actually pretty neat they are like blue on one side around here here and green on the other side and the top is pretty nice so what we're gonna do is I'm, I'm going to dress her up now and then maybe I'll zoom on her and show her to you let's see let's start with the dress I try to put some pulley clothes on my so so before and it was a little bit difficult but normally like the if you buy the pinky clothes they are kind of made especially for her type of body so normally they are pretty easy to put on like the outfit of my so so before was really easy to put on as you can see here so now I just have to close the bow, be careful with her hair Oops. <gasps> weak trouble, well I guess that's better let me tidy up the bow, I'll put the wig back later so she actually comes with a wig cap her wig is going to be a mess now, oh no see she comes with a wig cap so that the wig is not supposed to slide, but it's lit anyway. So, dress, and now let's see this. The hardest part is always the hands because I'm always a little bit scared of breaking the fingers when I put on things. Okay, let's try the other one. I think I put it upside down. Let's try again. Okay. All the way through. Yep, that's better. The other one. Okay, and then socks. Okay. Let's 
Oh, what's that? Oh, there is like an extra pair of socks coming up with a shoe. That's really nice. So extra pair of socks that I didn't know about. And then the shoes. So the shoes are pretty cute. Like, it's like big heels and then you have like pink polka dot and less and I'm not sure how I'm gonna be able to put on that shoe seems a bit tight let's try yeah there is all those little things just wait a second because there is a mm. let me remove there is like like it was seen through and through for some reason so our feet can't go in it's really weird it didn't happen like that with my so so before so I'm not sure why this one has that okay one more okay all this little thing I don't know Okay, and it's the same in the other one. I have no idea why it's like as if that less was seen from here to here and back and forth. Just so weird. And it's glued on, on top of it, so I have no idea why. There is all those little thing inside. And my scissor is not so good as the tip of it, so... Uh. Okay, a little bit more. Okay. So I have no idea why there is so much thing in those shoes. Seems a little bit unnecessary. So anyway, here she is. And she's going to need underwear at some point because she has no underwear. <gasps> My goodness. So let's try to put on the wig and the funny thing is my first one, my so so, when she arrived uh, her head was open and her wig wasn't on and it took me forever to be able to put her wig on so I just hope this one is not going to be the same and her wig is a little bit of a mess so um, I'll probably have to take my doll comb later and take care of her better so here let's pull on the wig <laughs> it looks like it's fine at the bottom but it's not fine at the top it's so here we go be careful the eyelashes here we go her hair is a mess but I'm going to zoom on her and show her to you from close up she is adorable Miko has always been my favorite doll. I got a so, so first because I won her, but Miko is always a face that I really liked. So I'm going to take care of her hair a little bit and then I'm going to show her to you from close up. So this is Miko. So depending on the name of the doll, you have different face. But uh, this one is the one without much of a sheen. She has her upper lips going up on top of our lower lips so you can see there is a large difference and the sheen is kind of absent and she has a rather flat face 
so you can see the, the face is rather flat and she has a small little nose and small little ears on each side and she has kind of big eyes and the, what I like with those dolls is that they have some kind of like kind of countryside looking and their face is not really 100% symmetrical but they have this kind of innocent cuteness to them like little kids who are like going to go and get dirty and do stuff so I re like I ask for a freckle face so you can see she has freckles around her eye she has freckle on her nose and on her cheek and she also has blush everywhere like on her nose and cheeks she has small eyelashes different lengths of eyelashes and she has those like the glued eyelashes are pretty long and only on the side and then she has nice looking eyebrows on the same color of the wig so it looks pretty neat on her and then if you can see her eyes her eyes are pretty nice like they kind of seems to follow you like they follow the camera when I turn the door like she's always looking at you and she has like one side light blue and the other side is green so I really like her eyes she's adorable and of course she has like motion so she can move her head from side to side not so much to the front but she can go back pretty nicely then she has motion at the elbow and at the shoulder and at the wrist she's single jointed so there is like you cannot also pose her so much like there is basically two positions either the arm is long or bent but you cannot you cannot really have her like in between maybe it's because it's she's like string so tightly then the elbow is also moving so you can rotate the arm far back like it rotates really well basically everywhere and it goes up that much but if you rotate it it goes up as well so much down it's pretty nice then she has like joint at the hips so you can move her legs up and down so she sits really well like she sits like 90 degree so that's perfect sitting position which is kind of rare on my dolls actually most of my dolls don't have this perfect upright sitting position but basically it's like same you cannot really move like well you can leave her leg hang I guess but then for the knees it's the same as the arms either it's straight or it's bent but you don't have much in between like if you put it up it's going to go back by itself and you have articulation at the ankle as well so you can rotate the feet and it move up and down so that's pretty nice to take picture you can take her out and take some picture of her and she is absolutely a cutie like and that outfit suit her really well so but I thought it came with pants she was supposed to get pants but the pants are not in the box so I don't know why and the color are also a little bit different so I guess it just depends like the shape of the outfit is the same the material is the same but the color probably depends on how the dye is going or what's available whenever you try to get the doll so guys I hope you enjoyed this video I'm going to dress up so so probably in this new outfit and then I'm going to take picture of Miko and Soso together. I hope you're going to like that. And she has a little rabbit here. Yeah, it's so nice that she had a companion to travel with her. Anyway, I'm really happy with this doll. She's absolutely adorable. 
and I wanted a Miko for a long time like I was like looking at the page of that artist on Facebook I was in the group and I basically never ordered a doll and then I won the so 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 I got the so so ask for like I had a blank so so and I asked them to actually like make the face up and put clothes on her in a week before sending her to me so I obtained like a full like I paid the difference between the blank doll that I won and the full set so so that I wanted so I got my so so and so I was like okay I don't need to buy another doll because yeah I already got the so so but I really wanted a Miko so now I'm I'm really happy to have her and so so is going to have a friend of the same kind because they are very particular ball jointed doll I have other ball jointed doll but they don't really suit with each other because their style is so completely different so no, so so as a friend and that's going to be nice to have them both around to take picture and play and that kind of thing anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this video please let me know what you think about these big pinky dolls and don't forget to like this video and give me like leave me your comment about whatever basically I'm always enjoying having conversation in the comment section with you about anything you like and see you next time for something else have fun whatever you do bye